Hello, good morning. This is your daily outlook for Wednesday, the 12th of December. The euro rose higher against most of its major counterparts ahead of the Federal Open Market Committee decisions. The Fed will conclude a two-day meeting and is expected to announce the purchase of $45 billion of longer-dated treasuries per month beginning in January to replace the current Operation Twist programme, which expires at the end of the month. Under the Operation Twist program, the Fed sells shorter-dated U.S. government debt and buys longer-dated treasuries to extend the duration of its balance sheet. As this expansion is expected, a different outcome could cause sizable movements in the market. The British pound advance versus the U.S. dollar rising from 160.69 to 161.16, while the Australian dollar recorded a new high of 105.40, benefiting from heightened risk appetite. The US 500, which tracks the SPI, and the US Tech, which tracks the Nasdaq, both recorded yearly highs yesterday, and their performance has captured investors' attention worldwide. Equity indices are traditionally strong in December, and this can also be confirmed by the steady appreciation of the UK 100, which tracks the FTSE, and the JER 30, which tracks the DAX. All rebounded against the US dollar yesterday after falling for five straight sessions ahead of the week's organisation of the Petroleum Exporting Countries meeting over its output and to choose a new Secretary General. Now let's take a look at what the currencies are doing this morning. The euro dollar pivot point at 129.10 with a preference to enter into long positions at 129.20. The dollar yen pivot point at 82.45 with a preference to enter in short positions at 82.40. The Aussie dollar pivot point at 104.90 with a preference to enter in short positions at 104.90. The sterling dollar pivot point at 160.40 with a preference to enter into long positions at 160.40. And the dollar cap pivot point at 0.9890 with a preference to enter in short positions at 0.9890. Looking at commodities and indices. The oil pivot point at 87.60 with a preference to enter into short positions at 87.60. The gold pivot point is at 1.684 with a preference to enter into long positions at 1.684. The silver pivot point at 32.50 with a preference to enter into long positions at 32.50. The US 500 is at 1.405 with a preference to enter into long positions at 1.405. And the UK 100 is at 5.926 with a preference to enter into short positions at 5.926. And of course, for to date information, please visit us at easy-forex.com. And watch out for these market movers. In the UK, we have the claimant count in November forecast at 7,000 new unemployment claims. In Europe, we have the industrial production month on month in October forecast to rise by 0.2%. In the US, we have the Federal Reserve rate to remain unchanged at 0.25%. And we have the crude oil inventories forecast to decrease by 2.6 million barrels. And our interest of today is the JER 30, which produced a remarkable surge yesterday, recording a high high at 759.730, a figure not yet seen since the beginning of 2008. The equities index first broke through the 7555 resistance area and appreciated by 0.7%. This area is now expected to act as a support level in case of retracement, by the, but the outlook still remains bullish. Thank you for watching our daily outlook for the 12th of December. We look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. I'm Emma Andre from the Easy Forex Dealing Room. Have a great day. Not only have you found a great place for Forex news, you found a great place to trade it. Registration is easy. Just click join now. Membership has its unique benefits, such as the freeze rate, the trade simulator, the inside viewer, and personal dealers. Your personal account manager waiting for you now.